Hello YouTube and welcome back to Silva Sagas. A year in review and we're going to tell you about our goals for 2019. So without further ado, we'll start with Jacob. Hello. Hello YouTube and welcome back to Silva Sagas. A year in review and we're going to tell you about our goals for 2019. So without further ado, we'll start with Jacob. Hello. I goals that I want to start this year is getting money and how I'm going to get that is find a job probably work at the closest Rouse, do groceries and help, uh, get some money so I can save up for a car, which is number two. Get a car so, so I can drive, I can get somewhere, go to work. Don't really need to get a car and drive there, even though I can just ride down there on a bike or walk but still want a car and then three get a license so i can drive that car <laughs> <laughs> so three becomes before two before one so yeah, right much, it's reverse yeah. okay reverse. All right, that's, sometimes it happens that way mm -hmm. so any academic goals uh, don't fail high school. Okay. Yeah, that's a good goal. <laughs> that's a good Very goal. Good goal. <laughs> don't drop out. <laughs> yeah. How about get higher than a D? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's, let's say that. Higher than a D, D minus. minus. Okay. <laughs> okay, please. Okay. No Ds. All right. Jimmy? For me, um... One of the goals I had last year was saying that I wanted to lose weight. Well, as you see, I'm just as big, or not bigger, fluffy. <laughs> well, the thing is, is that I found out that I had a lot of medical problems, and I'm trying to get to the bottom of it and working on it. So, by that term, hopefully, I will be able to lose some weight and feel better and healthier. Um, I think that's when you get older that your goals change, and you know, everybody wants. I want a new car, I want a new beautiful house, I want it. health, that's the biggest thing. I think also that um, I want us to feel that we're um, financially stable, that we don't feel like we're going by paycheck to paycheck. Uh, we want to feel that we're comfortable that if work stops for a little bit, I'm fine. I can, we can make it. That's one of one of one of my two goals that I feel like I want to achieve. Um, moving up in my career, I, I did. I moved up. I moved up as a foreman. I I enjoy it, but I also like what I do. So that's an, I think, achievable goal that I'm working on. So what are you about you, babe? Well, I broke my goals into five parts. Oh. And let me explain. Last year... I had some goals to grow my business and at the end of the year I quit my business. I shut it all down in October and I traveled with my children, my oldest child and his family from Washington to Georgia and that gave me time to reflect on whether or not I was going to come back and, and do my business or if I was going to quit it altogether and I decided to quit it altogether. So the office manager or the um, the office manager dot biz or um, LMS remote office services has been shut down and I am focusing now on our YouTube channel taking care of my family um, and doing a blog um, hopefully to monetize but if that doesn't happen right away I'm in no hurry um, I we were spending a lot of money. My business was um, 
was causing us to spend an awful lot of money that we just didn't have. My husband funded that business for five plus years. And while it started making money, it still wasn't enough. And it was turning into a business that I just didn't love anymore. So I'll look down at my, my goals. My personal goals this year is to my health, um, to exercise daily. I want to eat better. I want to do a sugar detox. Um, I crave sugar terribly. Um, another goal I have is to meditate mornings in the mornings <laughs> and to be productive throughout the day. So that was my personal goal. My family goals are... <laughs> to have at least one family vacation a year hey. a nice family vacation and to get away in our local area if you none of us none of you know we live in the los angeles area and there are a ton of things to do locally and on the weekends we typically just sit here and veg on tv and we're not really out as a family so we're close to the beach we're close to the science center we're close to the, the reagan library the lakes we bought yeah. kayaks last year that you saw on youtube and we've used Only them touch water once that we've used them three times <laughs> three times <laughs> um i have spiritual goals not a lot of you know that we are christians and due to my business i didn't want to offend or put people off with my um uh, Christianity or my beliefs so it's not something that I would bring up often but at home I would like to read a scripture a day and reflect on it and apply it to my life and then my home goals I have I would love to redecorate I am very much into the farmhouse look um, during my travels with my children, we were able to stop in Waco, Texas at the Magnolia Farms and the Magnolia Silos, and I fell in love with that style, and that is how I want to decorate my home. So that is a, um, a, a passion of mine that I want to redecorate. Um, and then I have financial goals. I want to stick to a budget monthly. And... A little kudos to Jimmy and I. We went to Walmart yesterday, and we were going to buy <laughs> we were going to buy a toaster oven. But guess what? It wasn't in the budget. We had it in the basket. We looked at each other and asked each other, "Is it in the budget?" It wasn't in the budget, so we put it back and we came home. Yeah. We bought the things that we needed and that were in the budget, and then that was it. Yep. So that is a yay, yay. for us. It, tell you one thing. The toaster oven got to see Walmart a little bit. We went around a little bit and said, oh, no, you got to go back home. Yep. So we put it back in the shelf. Yeah. <laughs> so that was one. Um, as far as, um, you know, YouTube, I want to grow our YouTube channel. We want to put out more videos. Um, Jimmy being a foreman now, he can actually videotape some of the jobs that he goes to. So we can have some Lyman videos. We'll have some Teenage Yanks videos wait what yanks, yanks. <laughs> what? Uh, we will have some fun titus animal videos uh, uh, if you know titus he is our great dane lab mix he is a bundle of joy uh cooking videos i am also and one these guys of, and this these guys we have oreo here and shadow who is outside chasing bunnies yeah um also quilting crafting and i am my new passion is a happy planner if my, some of you don't know what a happy planner is it, it's a, a planner your daily productive planner that you can put stickers on and there's something so cathartic about putting stickers on a page and writing it in um and doing the lettering and the calligraphy it's all very very um it it uh, winds me down, uh, resets me. It's just something I, I found a new passion for. So stay tuned. Yep. I More didn't. videos to follow. And You know, a lot of things that, you know, my wife mentioned that she's going to do. I think that Jacob and I would need to show you some of the things that we're doing. Um, 
we go out shooting. We love to go shooting guns out here and target shooting. You know, I understand a lot of people are not really into guns. And I I give you, you know, I understand your, you know, what you stand for. And I, that's fine. You know, please do not, you know, you know, said comments that guns are bad. Well, okay, whatever. Keep them to yourself. I appreciate that. I think that other things that we can do, like, um, unfortunately, we've been waiting for this part to fix our compressor. And then when we get that part, we will show you what we did, how to fix it. And that may be just a little fun thing to show you that, you know, that we're doing together. We have worked on my truck, and basically it's going to be his truck in the future to drive. <laughs> So, you know, things that we're taking care of. You know, every day to day is things that we all do. You know, things that teaching. I want to teaching. Teaching Jacob how to drive. So yes. you'll come along on some of our driving lessons. Yeah. Um, we do have a mount for the camera, so don't worry about hands or, or hand free devices. Or yeah. hand free devices and if we're paying attention or not. Sorry, but I have a spray bottle between my legs because Titus wants to join it. So bad. So bad. So. Anything else, son? Anything else? Oh. Um, I think you should pop on the camera every so often during homework and show them what your homework is. Yeah. Why not? Why not? It's a teaching lesson. I rarely get homework. Yeah, that's classes. true. Should he say hi? Yeah. Come on, Titus. Come here. Come, Come here. here. There he comes. He's jealous because the cat was up here. So. <laughs> He's small. He's, He's a our lap, lap dog. dog. Yeah, 135 pound lap dog. <laughs> so, ugh, I, I benched that. <laughs> <laughs> so, like we were saying, that we have a lot of places to go and see around here. My wife been living here for how many years? Um, I'm 51. <laughs> Still got it. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a lot to do. 15 years. <laughs> yeah. So our next video coming up will either be a lineman video or I have some craft videos coming up about my happy planner and how I'm going to put my goals together um, and who inspires me in on YouTube to do those things. Um, the guys, they have some inspirational videos that they watch and they'll tell us who inspires them. Yeah. Um, we are planning our retirement, so we'll have some retirement plans that we'll share with you. Um, a lot of things coming up to look forward to. Yes. And if, if you're not from the LA area, or if you are, I would love suggestions. Mm -hmm. Places like that, or places that you guys have not seen or want to know about. We'll, we'll head over there and take a look at it. We'll take some video and tell you what we can find, what's the best value of certain things, um, what we enjoy about it, what we kind of watch out that it was kind of like a scam or whatever. Mm -hmm. Things to kind of watch out, maybe give you ideas, and if it's worth it. Mm -hmm. You know, we'll just put it out there and you guys decide. So Also, we'll, we'll be traveling to Georgia for our son's 30th birthday. 30 years old. 30 years old and so we'll be spending time with our two grandsons and our son and his wife and showing you the sights of Georgia. Yep. So um, all coming up. Yep. Yep. I'm going. Yay. <laughs> I gotta see Georgia. Yep. So well thank you for everything. We'll Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe Wherever and appear. stick with us. Or is it down there? Or yeah or down there. there. <laughs> Yeah. That way. This way, this way. <laughs> <laughs> that way. All right. Thank you.